Isanaba. Where is my princess? Are you deaf or dumb? Do you think I have water inside my mouth? Where is my daughter? Your Majesty, she didn't tell us where she was going. Yes, yes, Your Majesty. Your sister lay here like inanimate object for me, this rubbish. You don't know the whereabouts of my daughter? Now get out of my presence immediately. Out of my presence! Get lost! Rubbish! I went all the way to a Neri kingdom to see him against my orders. Oh, I'm very sorry. I love him. I love Prince of Please, please me. You love Prince of I have decided that I and that family will not have anything in common. My forefathers and their forefathers have been in enmity. And it must continue, hear me, from generation to generation, even to the third generation, I don't care. And I'm very sorry, I do not understand what you're talking about. Because obviously, Prince Agudiri did not offend you one bit. I have decided, and that is final. You have nothing to do with that family. Talk alone, one was family. It is not possible. Get out of my presence. Throw this out! Monkeys! Down! Down! See your girl fogging out. Osile! Osile! I assign you with the sole duty of being around my daughter wherever she goes. Do not, and I repeat, do not allow my daughter to leave your presence. Make sure you follow her wherever she goes. Have I made myself clear? Yes, Your Majesty. Out. It is only the crocodile that kept his mouth wide open that allows the river birds to peck out. Not in my time. Rubbish. Azubike, my prince, tell me, 
What do you think about Princess Kira? Hmm. Princess Kira is very beautiful. And I think she's the only woman who is fit enough for the Prince of Aniri Kingdom. Right. However, I'm only concerned that her father, Iguita Bansuden, I would not want her to have anything to do with you. As if okay. My prince. Allow me to worry about that. Nothing good comes easy. If it were to be easy, then we weren't meant to be together. I'll handle it. Urezan is my maternal home. And I know Igweta Bansudene to be a very stubborn king. I know him. <laughs> As a VK, when you sound negative, you begin to respond negatively. You need to be positive. I am sorry, my friends. And I pray that soon, the both of you will be joined together as husband and wife. Ise. <laughs> Untouched. You insist you don't want to eat. No, thank you. I don't want to eat. But it's morning. You have only to do. You need breakfast I in your tummy. I'm not hungry. Uh, I'm not. I'm not hungry. Because of the prince. You'd rather sit here and starve. Eh? Santa. I know it's my sins, like I'm, I'm running mad, but I'm not. I'm only hopeful, and I believe that one day the prince will be all mine. Yes, I'm very, very hopeful. He will be mine. <laughs> do, do you think you stop it? <laughs> <laughs> so, so you rather eat your wishes and fantasy than eat your breakfast. Is it not better? It's not. Ah, it's not. Look at me. You are a maid. A maid. Yeah. Look at maid. Palace maid. Guys, any which way you want to follow it, a maid. A maid cannot have the prince. It does not work that way. Yen Ligi, I'll eat it now because it came I didn't have enough of mine. I will take yours Go now. Go ahead and eat it. I want to be left alone with the thought of my prince. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I've heard of madness, so. In fact, I've heard of different kinds of madness, but can't they make now? This one that has possessed you is the Ogapata of all madnesses. You are serious. Hmm. You are serious. <laughs> and sometimes you're distracting me. I'm trying to concentrate and see the face of my prince. Juan, <laughs> eat the fantasy while I drink your tea and eat your bread. Go ahead and drink the tea. I'm not interested. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'll eat it. I'll eat it. Just don't come and tell me you changed your mind. <laughs> Begin our long love. The occupation they want to be. When they grow up. <laughs> the dreaming of a man. I wish you well, you know. <laughs> Chi, I'm, I'm pouring it now. Asomta, go ahead and eat it. Leave me alone. Drink the tea. Eat the bread. Oh, my maka. Oh, maka. Can you go for now? Can you go for now? Can you go <laughs> How dare you tell my father the king where we went to? Are you mad or something? You went there. I'm very, very sorry. I was so scared to lie to the king of who is that. 
the consequences is very disastrous, especially for a male woman. Now you see what it cost. You can see right now that he has assigned a guard who follows me around to, to give him every details of my movements. I'm sorry, it wasn't, it wasn't intentional. Now, Uruna, listen to me very carefully. You better figure out a way to deal with this bullshit. Because I do not want that idiot anywhere near me. Alright? Now, what are you coming here to do? I command you this night, as your princess, to quit following me. Disappear from my sight, I don't want you around me. My princess, do I rather disobey the king? Now what is it? What? Stop following me, stop following me! need your services. When I need it, I will call you. I'm, I'm sorry, my queen. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. But, but I don't want to incur the wrath of the prince. He, he keeps telling me that I should be at your service every day in this palace, my queen. The prince is my son. I will talk to him myself. My queen, please, my queen. But the wages that the prince pays me is an important source of livelihood for my family. If I stop working here, how do I make money for my family, my queen? Because they are, I'm begging in the name of God to go home immediately. Go home now. I command you as the queen of an early kingdom. Go home immediately. My queen, please. Go! Please think about I love my gate after I said go. So, what are you doing here? Eh? And if I may ask, how is that your business? I said, how is that your business? This is my business because this is my challenge. I mark it. Oh, I see. I am very sure you are not going in there in order to suggest the prince because I will bring out your eyes for you to chew. Oh. Try me. Anyway, Chilota is not in the mood for people like you. Hey, 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 where did you go? Come back here. Why are you walking? I don't blame her. Oh. Hey, 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 Hey! So why are you talking about her? Give me. This girl stopped me. Oh, I've been nagging for a long time. Telling me, eh, I'm taking the prince away from him. She wants the prince. 
She sees me as a threat. Nezene bo oba alumu na chiwa nzee zote na prince nani? Obu ya? See me see trouble. Hey, but she's lucky. She's lucky that I am in a good mood. Makobu ya? Hey hey. So it's because of chiwa you were screaming down the entire village just and hearing your voice. Maka chiwa nza. Oh, you ma kwane kale. Are you not better than her? <laughs> In every ramification, on my level, I'm looking at you, Wenza. You just need to be cool Stop it, though. Behave. <sighs> we both know the prince is yours. So, so be quiet. Sister, oh, hey, me, I cannot take it, oh. I will not take it. My prince is mine, and nobody, nobody in this village will take him away from me. I'm not betting, Wenza. You just dress, oh, Makada, mama. Hey, I will go inside and bring water in one minute. Hmm? Drink a lot of water and cool down your temper. I need the water. Please, I need the water. But I will show her. I will be a That doesn't matter. Come on, Papa. It's yours. I want you and get out. Hey, Chimwenza. Okay. Call the corner and throw today. Hey, Chi. I got you. The earlier you understand how important it is for you to get married, the better for you. Mother, can any day go by without you talking about marriage? That is the stage you are in now. And that is one thing you must do to save this royal family from humiliation. If I may ask, who exactly is humiliating the royal family? It's you when your uncle told me to ask you to see him this evening. And it's very important. I don't think I'm ready to see him play that strict uncle towards me. The more reason you must see him. Wait a second. Why exactly am I seeing him? I'm sure he wants to rant about reasons why I should get married. And it's not enough reason for him to rant about? Or it's not enough reason to deliberate upon? Oh, please, go see your uncle. Mother, I'll get married when I'm ready. And for your information, I won't marry anybody you provide. Mating or whatsoever. I have someone I want to marry, and that's who I am going to marry. I'm so confused. I'm a resume. My throne has stayed. Or guinea come get me. On your guy one more. I went to the palace to help the queen. She asked me to go home that she does not need any help now. Can you get me one? Again? Mama, are you sure she's not looking for a way to tell her son to relieve you of your duty at the palace? Why are you Mama, that one is our business. So. Honestly, it's not my business. I cannot kill myself over a queen that does not need any help. Mama, allow me to eat this food. Kobulu nkenje teta. Mama, we ba no no. Ije di eni. I'm ready, Kao. No. Hey. 
time. I'm not happy. I'm not. I know now. Give me. <laughs> Is he not a prince? What happened again? You, 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 you know how much I love the prince. Hmm? Oh, he's not looking my way. I don't know what to do. I'm tired. I'm confused. I, I, I don't know what to do again. So this is why I've been sitting here waiting for you to talk. You're this moody over an issue known as Ijoksu Pasiamake. We just talked about the prince. And I said, it's yours. What? Ha. What I new has happened in I this saw situation? That you, you remember when I got the opportunity to work at the palace mm -hmm. as the queen's maid? Mm -hmm. I was happy. Mm. I was glad. I was happy that at least this is an opportunity. For me to be closer to my prince. But the queen, the queen will not allow me to shine. The queen will not allow me to be at the palace and capture the attention of my prince. I'm not happy at all. I'm not. Chi. Chi. In as much as I am aware of your desire to become the prince's bride, your ambition to be his wife, now that the situation is bringing you to tears, it's time we give it very critical evaluation. <laughs> Let's analyze the situation critically. <laughs> Do you think that the prince in his royalty, societal status, educational background, exposure, all that makes him think. Do you sincerely think that he will fancy a bride from a family like ours? <laughs> you remember who we are? Are you seeing the disparity? Uh, sometimes stop it. Stop what? You're not making this thing. I easy. am being realistic. What are you being realistic about? What are you saying? Uh, sometimes, uh, sometimes you know this. When I marry the prince, everything will change. Our lives will change. Oh, good. Take a look at us. Look at our house. See all these blocks. Everything has to go into work. I need to marry the prince. I love the prince. I don't care whether the higher and the mighty or other girls. I don't care. I am meant for the prince. And the prince will be mine. G. That's all I do. G. <laughs> it sounds more like you're interested in him for what will come out of it. No. Or you love him for real. I love him for real. I love him with everything in me. <laughs> I love him and you know it. G. The prince must be by even the queen cannot stop me. See, you take a mirror now. I'll bring a mirror so it's shaking. Take it easy with yourself. Watch your emotions. Kill a with high blood pressure. Don't get high blood pressure. You're a little girl. Oh. Before this overwhelming love of yours drive you to a chemist. You I don't care. The desires of the righteous shall never be cut short. Yes. And my God knows that. My God is bigger than everything. Even the queen. Oh, Joseph the dreamer. We hear you. We hear you. Never. Uncle, that's totally impossible. I completely disagree with you. I am the heir to the throne. I have the right to demand for more time. Ogudu Nero, everybody in the kingdom is sick and tired 
of your inability to get married. People are let that you are important. Or oh, are you important? Uncle, how can you say a thing like that? Did you hear yourself? I am not impotent. I just asked for more time. <laughs> this is three years since the death of my brother. If people want to ask for time, it cannot be more than seven months or at least one year. But you've left Aniri for the past three years without a king. Nobody is ready to wait for you again. For your information, we've made our conclusion that if you cannot provide us with a woman, we will throw the whole thing open for another king to emerge. Uncle, that is not the right thing to say. That cannot happen under your watch. You cannot allow the genealogy of kingship pass or leave our family lineage. That's impossible. That is why I told the queen that I want to see you immediately. Oh, have you seen a wife? Have you gotten anyone? Well, I, I saw one, but it's complicated, uncle. It is. That is to say that what the queen said is right. Because she told me that you are in love with an unknown uh, uh, maiden. You've not told anybody the name of the maiden. Maybe it is uh, there's my name. Well, you know, you kept it within yourself. Uncle. Yes? It's enough. All right? It's enough. I'll do something about it as soon as possible. You better do something as soon as possible. But let me remind you. Our saw is iron that throne. And you know he has a, a, a very rich son. Who is ready to sponsor him? Uncle, that's impossible. That cannot happen under my watch. Not in my time. Ah. Yes. Then do something. Before the quest of a kinship of an Aniri is thrown into a war zone, let me tell you, if you cannot get a wife by yourself, I will help you and get one. There are many beautiful men in, in our community. I'll get you one. Oh, I must go and remember. Abu Ma Amunolo, Zololo. Kono kweli, etereta. Hey. Take. I've come to ask you to stop that guard from following me around. His presence makes me uncomfortable. Osile will continue to be around you as far as you continue with your activities in and out of this kingdom. But father, I'm not a child. Why subjugate me to such level of embarrassment? I want you to stop seeing Ogodiniro, but you continue to see him secretly. Like I said, Osila will continue to move around you. And if you dare bring any information that you have anything to do with that young man, I will cut off your ears and drop in your palm for you to eat it. Okay, Father, I promise you, I'll stop seeing Prince Agudiniro. But as for that boy, please withdraw him away from me. Just stop him. Switch your mind back. You promised me before. I listened to you. I do not want to be fooled the second time. Promises, promises, promises. If I dare see you around that young man, if I dare, leave my presence. Leave my presence! <laughs> to think that I've been a king in this kingdom for several seasons. Little rat like this flouts my orders. Rubbish. This is an age-long enmity. And I will continue to keep what must be kept. If we're in Rubbish. Iwe ofu bossy ofoginanya. What? What is it? Oh, any 
anything you can get for me. Fine. I would like you to go in there. Help me convince my father to change his mind. Can you do that? You can't, right? Now listen to me. Next time, don't come asking me if there's any stupid thing you can do for me. Because you can do absolutely nothing. It's not your fault. Spoilt brat. It's only the matter of time I'll put you in your place. Mm. And who are you putting in there? I thought you said you have fallen in love with Prince Obutino. Mm -hmm. What are you still doing with that Wednesday? I'm old enough to get married. I'm desperately in need of a man to marry me. I'm weighing my options. If Prince of Good New does not work, I mean they will work. But now it has become obvious that Prince Obudunu does not love you or want to marry you. So why isn't Anise coming to pay your bride price? Again, because of you. How? Asanta, every time Anise comes to this place, you barge in and you embarrass the young man. So how do you expect that young man to get serious with me? Or marry me when my only sister does not see him as a man. Is that what he told you? Of course. That, that man. <laughs> Arizona does not love you. He does not love you. No. He's not in love with you. He's playing on your senses and you're falling for it. Do the wise thing and run away from him now. I don't, I don't want to know. All I know is that I want to get married. And I must get married this season. Come on December, it will not pass me by. Okay. Good luck. understand why you asked Chilota to leave. Why did you believe her of her duties? Which duties, if I may ask? Take care of me? Am I sick? Do I look incapacitated to you like this? I can't take care of myself. But mother, you hardly know your way around this house. It's a lie. I know everywhere. But instead of you to bring your daughter-in-law, your wife, that can show me around, instead you went and hired a maid. What does the maid know in this house? Mom. There's nothing a wife can do for me that you cannot do for me. That's not true. Bring a wife that can cook for you, Ogubdiniru. Bring a wife! I spoiled you with your wife responsibilities. And you take that privilege as a liberty. What is that? But mother, are we going to go over this again? Yes. Because we've never had any conclusion on this. Marry! Get a wife and marry. So that you can claim back your rightful position as a king of this great kingdom. Oh, can do? Get married, or if all job. For mother, I, Ogudiniru, I have told you time and time again that I will find a wife and I'll bring her to you. We don't have to nag about this. If you don't want to get married because you want to claim back your rightful position, marry because you want your mother to hear the voices of her grandchildren run around this compound making her happy. Look at your height. That you gone? 
Look at how big you are. You should Mom, get. You know what? It's too early for this. Honestly, it's just too early for this. Too early for this. Okay, maybe this wife you're talking about is a mummy, because no one has seen her in this palace, nor around this community. Who is that girl you want to get married to? You know what? This is good. What? Why are you making me run away from me? I'm not here. I'm not here. Come back 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 here. I'm going to the palace today. I don't even know if I want to go. I'm tired. Every time I go there, the queen will just send me back. I'm tired of going to that palace, honestly. If I were you, I'd show up in that palace every day. Yes. Keep showing up. So the prince will get to notice you more and more. But your lazy self will not allow your mind to think of the strategies to use and get the prince's attention. He has stopped it. You're right. Then you can dress up. I'm going to the palace now. around does not involve you meddling in my privacy all right i'm sorry my princess but i know privacy when i see one and this is not privacy i'm specially trained to capture and tame sneaky people especially when they want to disobey the king and what does that supposed to mean you disrespectful brat answer me it means i'm obliged to follow you anywhere you go to your privacy is only in your room and not here Okay, fine. See, just, you can have this. Just use it and, and get something for yourself, okay? You can just buy it. I'm sorry, my princess. I am not hungry. Usile, why are you doing this to me now? Why? Why are you doing this to me now? Can't you see that this whole thing is driving me crazy? You're choking me. Usile, listen. I need a break. I need a me time. Please. In the name of God, can you stop following me around? Please. Anywhere you want to go to, I'm following you.
Where you going? Please, I'm going to see the queen. <laughs> hey, behave yourself. Did I not instruct you to come to work early and leave when I ask you to? Yes, you did. But you know, my prince, anytime I try to do that, my queen will refuse and just send me away. She will ask me to go home. If she says that to you, insist you must stay back. Do not leave this palace. Do you understand me? Yes, Do we prince. have an understanding? Yes, my prince. I just don't know why some men are too blind to take her for a wife. Azubike, hmm? are you married? No. All right. She's a perfect wife for you. your sister fell on deaf ears. So I have come to talk to you about it. Tell your sister to stay away from my husband. Tell her to stay away from the prince. In fact, let her resign from her work at the palace. Else, I will pour her acid. Tell her that. If you riffraff dare step into my house to say nonsense like this ever again, I will make sure you regret ever coming in contact with any member of our family. You can do nothing. You and your sister cannot do nothing! Leave this place. I'm not going anywhere. I said I'm not place. leaving! Do your worst. What will you do? Come out! Nothing better to people to discuss a man. Our princess needs our help. Help? How? What are you guys doing? Every time it's either you guys are in one corner or the other, gossiping. What mischief are you planning this time around? Mm-hmm. All this is none of your business, right? Yes. Okay. Continue for time. You know me now. I will find out definitely. There is something off about Uchechi lately. How? How do you mean? <laughs> I don't know. I just feel it's not. It's up to no good, you know. I just feel she's up to hidden agenda, right? Exactly. Anyway, that is none of my business. I don't care what agenda she has. Our main concern now should be how to help our princess out of this palace. What? Help? But the king? Mm -hmm. The king doesn't have to know about it. <laughs> and Usile? I have a plan. Well, you're aware that I'm not meant to leave the princess' side. And why are you trying to convince me? Relax. Don't tell me you enjoy standing here all day. Surely even a strong and hard-working man as yourself could do with a little rest. 
and I'll also to stretch your legs won't get you fired. Except you suggest them the princess will magically disappear in her sleep. Thank you, but I have my orders and I'm keeping to it. Suit yourself. It's clearly you enjoy suffering. Princess went out and she'll be back soon. Please, just keep it as a secret so that the king will not find out. Hmm? Just do it for me, please. 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 All right. Thank you. Thank you. On your girl, one more.
but I'm tired of this hide and seek. My uncle is very upset with me. He feels I do not want to get married. The princess and I, we have found ways to speak to her father, to allow us be. I hope that works. But the truth is, if I tell you I'm not upset, then that's a lie. Look, if her parents cannot allow her marry you, look for another woman and marry from our kingdom. You aren't going to wait forever. You have all the women at your beck and call. You're the prince of an eerie kingdom. What do you have me do? Of course you know what to do, my prince. So go ahead and do them. Everybody is looking up to you. Your blind mother, your uncles and relatives, even the entire kingdom. You cannot ascend the throne of your late father without getting married first. If you lose the throne, your family will never forgive you. And neither will you forgive yourself. Look at the time. She's not even here yet. And I don't think it's right to start looking for her. I can't go to her kingdom to start looking for her. My prince, you see why it seems as if I'm taking side with your people? Because she's not even doing anything to remedy the situation and calm down agitation from your people. She's not worth the stress. So what do we do? Wait for her? Wait for someone we don't even know if she's coming or not. My prince, please, we need to go. Please. Azubike, I think we should give her some more time. Okay? Some more time won't hurt anyone, okay? okay. My prince, I think Princess Kira is taking advantage of the fact that you love her to place you on condition that is difficult for you to meet. Okay? So some more time, please. Alright? If she doesn't come, we can leave. Is that okay? Greetings, my queen. It's me, Chilota. <laughs> Chilota. Yes, my queen. Chilota, having someone run errands for me makes me feel so lazy. In fact, I drag my feet around this palace. And it makes me so sickly. I don't want it. Mother, you're right. But the prince insists I come and assist you. That's why I'm here. Why can't the prince, my son, or Gideniru, look your direction? You're a beautiful woman. Why is it difficult for him to get me a wife? Do you know that having grandchildren and a daughter in law is a blessing? Why is he denying me those? Why? My queen, you're right. I feel it's because you don't allow me to always come to the palace to assist you. Eh? Or, or maybe because he sees me as. A common maid. My queen. My queen, please. I beg you. Please, allow me to always come to the palace to assist you. That way, the prince will look in my direction. I will capture his heart. My queen. Also, you know, this is another means of getting money to sustain my family. Because uh, let me always come and assist you. Become my queen. You kept me waiting again. You kept me waiting again. I'm so sorry, my love. You know, I had to sneak out of the palace to come be with you. You had to sneak out? 
By the way, where are your mate? That is the point. She has to stay behind to help me distract Osile. And who is Osile? My father, the king, had to appoint a new guard to follow me around so we don't get to see each other anymore. Kira. You see what I have been talking about? When will this animosity from your father end? When? I'm so sorry, my love. Just take it easy. We will sort it out. Okay? Listen, I don't have time. I have no time by my side. If I don't get married from now till July, I'm going to lose the throne. The throne will leave my family line. Oh my God. I'm so sorry to hear about this. We will definitely work something out, okay? You just have to calm down. Have you seen the reason why I have to get married? I know. But you see, I have to rush home now. I don't want to fall into trouble. Kira, why are you stressing me? Why are you tormenting me? Kira. She loves you too. But she's stuck between love and the desire to make her father understand and come to terms about how she feels about you. Definitely, love must always win. Always. Azubike, I have heard that a million times. trying to say I'm ugly. Ha! God forbid. How can I say that? Never. Don't I look presentable for any woman to love me? Of course. Of course you are my prince. You're very handsome. Every woman's dream. Yes. Do I look irresponsible or important? Eh? Irresponsible? Yeah. No. My prince, are you impotent? No. Huh. I'm not. But my mother and uncle are the ones who think I am. With the way they put pressure on me to get married. My prince, it's not your fault. It's the joy of every mother to see the son get married oh. and then have children all over. I see. But they're hanging it on me. They are pestering me. Making me feel like it's a death sentence. Putting me on the edge of making decisions against my will just to save the throne. But they forget that Marriage is a lifetime thing. My prince, look around you for the perfect woman. Hmm? Yes, the perfect woman you seek is around you more than you can imagine. My prince. Hmm? 
Hmm? You need to have a meeting with your heart, your inner heart, and concentrate on your immediate environment. Because what you seek is just before you, but you can't even see it. It's just by your closet. Stretch your hands and grab it, my prince. And I know God will help you. He will see you through. I'm so confused. I'm a My throne has stayed. I'm so Prince Ogudunir is incapable of ruling our land. I don't know why every other person don't see it. He cannot get married. He cannot get married and I heard it's because he's impotent. Hey! Hmm? Watch your tongue! It's what I heard. Hey, do we? Before seeing it. Shut! What are you saying? You told me that came up with it. When did you start to listen to gossip? My cousin was me. Me kwa buma ju aderia. Piko. Hey, but mama. Hey, let me tell you. Prince Ogudiniru remains the potential king of this kingdom. Unless proven otherwise by tide of time and the king cabinets. Ihi kota kwa nisi. Mama, it's just very apparent that Ichi Onwaso is a Kwesili. He's capable of becoming a good leader. So why are they delaying in declaring him king? Asanta, that will never happen. Ichi Onwaso will never be my king. Not when my prince, Ogudiniru, is still alive. Oma <laughs> Meme. <laughs> Mama, like I was saying, Ichi Onwaso is eligible 
and capable. And when he becomes king, his son, my man, will become the prince. And I, his woman, will become the potential queen. Yeah. Mm. When that happens, G, mm? when I become the queen to be, I will make you my palace mate, my chief mate. Mm? And then you will serve me and my prince. Enough of this nonsense. <laughs> Don't tell me that both of you are fighting over the royal throne as if you are men. <laughs> Mama, please don't take me seriously. <laughs> I'm just joking. I'm only trying to ignite a form of anger in her, push her buttons a little, just to show her that when it comes to marrying royalty, to me, that is mere triviality. When placed in comparison to pursuit of destiny. Mm. Yes. Mm. Thank God, whoever the prince loves is not interested in him. Mm. Yes, very soon, Mama. People like you, people like her, people in the village start saying, Congratulations! July is not far from now. I don't know how it will happen. Maybe something magical will happen because what the prince could not do in three years or oh, in a few months' time. Don't worry. He will do it. He will do it in three months. He in will a few do months. it. What God cannot do does not exist. I'm just worried about you no, for God's sake. That's not true. Kira, you're not worried about me. You're a very selfish person. You're only worried about your father. Listen. Please. I am going to lose the throne because you haven't introduced me to your your family! You're raising your voice for crying out loud. My father could hear you. Please, can you bring down your voice? I don't want you to get into trouble. Where is your car? Where did you park? Look, I am not stepping an inch from here. Kira, Leave me. Where are you taking me to? Kira, we need to talk. We need to talk! Bring down your voice, okay? Fine. Listen to me. If I don't get married before the end of July, I am going to lose the throne. I have to perform my duties as an Igwe during our New Year festival. And I have to do that with my Lolo. That's my wife to be. My ancestors will be mad at me if I do not get married because I'm going to lose the throne. 